Hello everyone, my name is David Lee and today we're doing a video video today. It's gonna we're gonna be reacting to the Premier League today because So every single team has played the last game of the season. So we're gonna call out all the points and all the scores. So here we go. I'll just put the camera like like this, so Sheffield United twentieth place, Sheffield Sheffield United. Play 38 games, so they've won 7, drawn 2, lost 29, they conceded 63 goals, scored 20, and they finished on 23 points. Well, Sheffield wasn't the greatest team, well, they were struggling a little bit, but they did win the last game, which was good. West Bromwich Albion, 19th, 26 points. Again, a decent team, but they're back down to the Championship. Look, every now and again, any team that goes up into Premier League will always go back down to, to the ch Championship. Okay. 18th place with 28 points, Fulham. Again, a good team, good team, but they didn't play the best this season. They had a bit of a struggle this season. And now not in relegation zone. 17th place with 39 points, Burnley. Burnley... Again, decent, decent game, and I mean that they, they lost, but they were good too, anyways. Brighton and Huff Albion, which Arsenal beat. Brighton didn't win the last game; that they lost the last game. They got forty-one points, which is still good. Fifteenth place, Southampton with forty-three points. Southampton did win the last game. Danny Ings has been great. Okay, let's check who scored for. Okay, what am I trying to say? West Ham, I mean, Southampton lost at their last game. So, I'm sorry, I'm being stupid. Okay, Crystal Palace, the 14th, with 44 points. Crystal Palace were a good team. But uh, again, Roy Hodgson is a good manager. He's a nice guy, he's a good manager. So, guys. Let's do a one second silence for Roy Hodgson. There. Roy Hodgson was a good manager. He's the oldest manager, but he's not retired. He's still good. But, okay. Next up, Wolf, Wolfhampton Wanderers with 45 points. Wolves lost their last game, but they got 13th this season, which is quite good, to, to, be, to be honest. Okay. 12th place, Newcastle with 45 points. Newcastle, we, trust me, we need to get Willock back. Joe Willock, please come back. Don't don't stay at Newcastle. Come back to us, please. Willock, you sexy pillock. <laughs> every time when Willock scores or every time when Willock misses a chance, we call him, oh, Willock, you stupid little pillock. <laughs> Well, he is a bit of a pillar, to be fair. Okay. 11th place, Newcastle. I mean, 11th, pl 11th place, Aston Villa. Aston Villa, a good season. They finished they finished higher than last season, which is good for Aston Villa. They played 38, drawn 7, won 16, lost 15. And they're, te they're 10 points clear from Newcastle. Now we're entering the, the top 10. 10th place with 59 points, Everton. When I was younger, I used, I used to call Everton, Everton, but they're called Everton. They finished 10th, tenth, tenth, not the best seasons for them. Not, not the best season for them. Again, they did all right. They did all right. They lost the last game. 5-0. <laughs> Sorry for that. Ninth place, Leeds United. Leeds were a good team. And, well, they played good. Especially their last game, 1-3-1 one three, three, one against West Brom. Penalty and thingy, thingy, thing, 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 thing. Okay. Eighth place. In eighth place, was 60, 61 points, Arsenal. I mean, Arsenal did have a good season. Well, it's not their best season. 
if Spurs lost or drew to Leicester, Leicester would have been in the Champions League and Arsenal would have been 7th. But damn you Spurs, damn you Spurs, you bag of dickheads. <laughs> Sorry about that. I mean, Arsenal had, a, Arsenal had a five winning streak form. Their form is win, 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 win. But, again, good ending to the season, but they could have done better in the first start of the season. Okay. Seventh place, Spurs. <laughs> I'm an Arsenal fan. I spot Arsenal. Spurs, seventh place. They somehow lucky Spurs. Arthur Bale or Kane scored 4-2. Now, Gareth Bale scored in the last six minutes. And Bale scored again. And then it was Curtis Michael with an own goal and Harry Kane. Oh, Faddy. Let's start a party. Scored two goals today. <laughs> Jane Fardy scored two goals. Jane Fardy, you know his chin? Jamie Fardy has a big chin. His chin is like Steptoe. <laughs> a witch face prick. <laughs> Okay, um, what's next? Now in a top six, West Ham, a sixth place with 65, 65 points. West Ham, good job. Good job for getting in a top six. You're now into the Europa League. Well, which they could have been in a Champions League, but they, they did, did not. Fifth place with 66 points, Leicester City. I mean, fifth place, Leicester City was 66 points. Leicester, good season. They're into Europe again. They're a fair good game for decent seasons. But yeah. Now into Champions League areas. The top four. Chelsea are finished fourth with 67 points. You know how bad Timo Werner was? Well, but Timo Werner, when he signed for Chelsea, he played totally... Shit. I mean, actually totally shit. And, um... Well... But it did play better later on, you know. But, Chelsea, good job. You're now in a top four. You're now in the Champions League again this season. I can... I applaud you. <laughs> now we're in a top three. Liverpool. Liverpool, I know, in a top three. Liverpool finished third. Liverpool finished third, but there were, Liverpool were in a top six a minute ago. Now they shot up back to third, where they usually belong in a top three in terms of it's, Well, well, I guess they did play good against old Roy Hodgson in the last game. Now the second place with 74 points, Manchester United. Again, they won the last game. Man United did pretty good. In the, in, the, in the end. But their rivals are above. Okay. Now. Last. But not least. Man. In first place. Played 38 games. Won. 27. Drawn. 5. Lost. 6. Scored. 83 goals. Conceded. 32. Goal difference. 51. With. 86 points. Smashed the top teams, Manchester City. And the trophy this season for the Premier League goes to the amazing Manchester City. They've won it again, as expected. How much? How much money? They, how much money? That? How much money they spend every season? Hundreds of millions spend on such good players, like. And it's Sergio, Sergio Aguero, he's left. The top striker, Sergio Aguero, has scored two goals in his last game, has now left Man City, because he, he, he did not sign any contracts. He's quit the club. So guys, thank you for watching my video. Like, subscribe. If you want me to do any more of those videos, maybe every, every time, I might check the score... So, look, every year, when every football season ends, 
we'll, we'll, we'll look at this every year and see how well they played. But we'll also look in the championship. The top, the top three teams will be coming into the Premier League. Hold on, I'll find it real quick. Hold on, give me a second, give me a second, give me a second, give me a second, give me a second. I'll find it quickly. Right. Championship table. Norwich City finished on 97 points. And Watford are also back in the Premier League. Now it's up to Brentford, Swansea. I've got a minute. Let's have a look at that. So... It will be Brentford, Brentford FC, and Swansea in the in the final of the Championship playoffs. So Brent, Brentford finished third, Swansea fourth. So it's either Swansea or Brentford to go in a champ in the Premier League. Barnsley. Oh look, Bournemouth. As we say, Bournemouth. <laughs> so guys, thank you for watching the video. Like, subscribe, stick in soon for more videos. Um, well, yeah. Stick in soon for more videos, I guess. Of them. What's this? <laughs> okay. Alright, guys. Thank you for watching the video. For the, for the football re interview of the scores and stuff and the rest of the stuff okay guys look at me right here three two one <laughs> yes you see my phone right there okay brr and okay bye guys